too. My name is Dark and Bleak Gaming, and I'm, I'm quite sorry for not uploading with for the past week. I was planning to make a video on Saturday, uh, as soon as my finals were over for my college, and then the day after, I immediately got sick with the flu for like five days, and I couldn't post anything because my voice was just like complete garbage. I was like uh, unable to do really anything for three days, and my voice didn't recover until today. So. Yeah, this is gonna be a showcase on uh, Aatrox Cade, which is another Aatrox deck, which I know I just did, but I love Aatrox, so I'm gonna make more. This is I, I haven't I've already I've made like five different Aatrox decks. I'm not gonna show off all of them just yet, but I haven't playing them in the time that I've been sick. So yeah, let's just nope nope not yet not yet. We have to show show you all the cards. So first we've got our Dark and you know. Dark and Ballista, Dark and Blood Letters, Dark and Aegis, Dark and Harp, Lodestone Spear, the, the normal amounts. Then we've got the one drops that you always want to have. Brew, Cultist, Forsaken Back High. These are just really good one drops for the deck. Momentous Choice, I don't think we really need to say. It's a buff spell that's quite good, and it protects our, our units. After this, we have Blooming Cultist. It got nerfed, so it's not as good anymore. You might want to drop some copies of this. But other than it's still giving elusive, and as we covered in the last video, anything that grants um oh yeah we have to keep her of the box because anything that grants itself a keyword will uh, will give the dark in that keyword if it assimilate assimilates with Aatrox. Then we've got ambitious cultist, which is a good value card, and if you can put uh, an equipment on it, it can survive a few strikes. So that's good. Furious wielder is removal, and it gives us strikes spells for Aatrox. Ranger Knight gives Scout, and it's a really good 4-drop. Uh, one Expanse's Protection is like a, a back back of the pocket um, protection, just in case. Heedless Resurrection brings back one of our champions, and it's always going to be activated. Then we've got 3 Kane, 3, three Aatrox, and 1 Zolani as a end of, end of game conditional finisher, if we really need it. So let's get into it. If I still see it, sound sick, sorry. So yeah, this is a Guerrero, it's a Caterina, not a Caterina, uh, a Kale deck. We're not going to trade down, we're instead going to set up a Dark and Blood Letters blocker. We tend the fire and hope for her return. It did one Yordle portal and suddenly geography means nothing. I will take this power in my lady's name. Come in, come in! Now we could equip it on this, but instead I'm going to... ...go with the extremely devastating... He does have a unit to throw away, but other than that, this is going to be quite effective. A bit underdressed. Why would you? That's th uh, that literally does nothing in that situation. If you're going to just throw it under the bus, why equip for mana? You're wasting it. Is it to buff up Solani? You're not going to have a chance. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is this is extremely aggro. Well, that's actually quite good. I can get rid of this. Easy prey. Yeah, you can buff up Zolani fairly consistently with Hollow. Yeah, this is created to, as no cost to us because both of the cards serve their purpose for it. So if he wants to waste a um, a kill spell on this, we are completely fine. Start off with an attack. So we can either go Kane or Aatrox. We don't need Aatrox at the moment. We want, to, we want to get him a bit closer to leveled up. I really wish we could see how many, how much we had discounted World before we played. Anyone seen any sheep around here? I uh, lost my. It's a knife's edge. If thing, if well, no, actually, it's not really because Kale's a bad chick, like just really bad. Like she's ne she never reaches this level of the game. That's probably a Zolani in the hand. That's why they've been buffing all this stuff. Trying to get it as big as possible. I don't think it's... It, it, there's no way it's hitting 16 yet. If it is, we would, we would be completely screwed. I think it, they, ha they do have three hollow deaths, so they don't need to have hit 16. Are we about to get blown up by 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 Zalon? That is the question. Because if we are, we're screwed, and there's nothing we can really do. If not, they're screwed because we're about to level. They probably, th if they do have Zolani, they probably think we have, um, we have, um, Frozen. Uh, the, the five cost. We, I didn't put that in my deck because it just got nerfed to five mana. I think I had one of it in there before. But five mana is a bit steep for that kind of effect. Death and shadow At that point, you, you, you probably just want to play, um, Unforgiving, no, not Unforgiving Cult, um, Harsh winds. Which, which harsh winds is in, in itself five mana, isn't it? Doesn't they buff it? Is he just AFK? He might just be A. Today 
Also, why did his Kale have a level up portrait from that? Yeah, they're AFK. They're not. They're not doing anything. So. Let's just cast the ult and win. And this is the, this is the most five head play by them ever. I mean, smart, right? I'm not too. The kids are saying these days. Unless they have vengeance, in which case I am sad. And you they didn't even get to go off. Yeah, they just they just DC. This is definitely a meta deck. It de it, it just got too nerfed in the hotfix. Yeah. This is definitely the more meta version of the um I, I also removed Garen from the deck that I was that I was playing because it turns out Garen just isn't very good. Uh, even with giving everything plus one plus one, Bane is just a lot better. It's really just stubbornness at that point. Holding on. Not really what I wanted. I wanted a one drop. I guess I was being a bit greedy there. Yeah, we need an aggro strat. This is not. This is not it. Really not it. Not much I really could have done there. Oh, well, now you show up. Real nice of you. All things can be analyzed, even darken. That's just taking it. I will take this power in my lady's name. If he wants to vent to ruination. Nope, it's buried in ice.
You are the tool. I am the weapon. Mized is a feeble mind. I seek a weapon worthy of Naga Keburus. This, this is, we did have a very good start. Another one, really? Yeah, this is the problem. Very nice obliterates your units. We didn't have a good start, and they have the counter to equipment, which is obliterates. See, this deck does have weakness, especially since they nerfed it. And here we are, Mirror. Sawed off, I'm the one who named my channel after this champion. That's kind of a problem when we don't want to waste our units. Because he's only invested one mana, I've invested three into this. Meaning we're kind of in a standoffish position. If I had drawn that last turn, that would actually be very good.
See, now that's a problem. We'll just, we'll just go all out. Weird how this one has, has a hammer icon next to the ability. Not this one. Thanks for the free unit. The child is gone. The killer remains. I'm gonna force him to burn his momentous choice here. To kill somebody that's ultimately cost me zero mana. He has his own Aatrox, he can't buff it, because otherwise he would have saved his cane. Does it show when he... No, it doesn't. This will bring it down to 8. By stacking this, I can get... I'd really dislike... Allow me to observe. He can't kill us next turn unless. Okay, he just straight up played Jorau. Okay, that's what he's doing. He's trying to kill my Aatrox, so I have to resurrect him. Things lay inside. 
aidé. If he wants to spend one of these to Okay, it is now impossible for him to kill this with his current setup. Unless he has um, the two mana. Even if he has, even if he, if he does soft Atrox from coming back, I still have a lot of life still. Certainly by these two, this transforming into Auras. Look, either you have an answer or you don't. Don't... This isn't chess. Great, now I kill now I kill your thing and I I heal up. See, that wasn't so hard. You just played the card that you had in your hand. And who do I want to challenge? Do I want to challenge the harp or this? I think I'll challenge Joral because he's the bigger threat. should have given uh, her the Darkened Blade, that way he would heal. He would heal himself. Now we need to draw an Aatrox, that's the problem. The box bestows for a price. No, I don't need another another Jor-Jor-Al. I've already got three. <coughs> Jesus, this guy is, is part of me. Okay, he cannot play it this turn. He is incapable of doing so. And he can't attack. No, if he attacks with this and then plays it. But then he can't equip. He's basically just getting. So we're fine.
Okay, dude, are you part snail or what? God, I hate ropers. The bigger the hunt, the better the trophy. Look, if the timer pops up every single time you take an action, that means you're broken. You are the tool. I am the weapon. Must be so feedy mind. First thing we do is assassinate his Aatrox. We assassinate his Aatrox, we assassinate this, so that he can't get any value off a Rolander. Cowards, be still. It never ends to your sin. Shadow and misery. Okay, but that means he can't cast this. No, he can still cast it this round. He's gonna cast it. Uh. The drop of war must sound one more time. No, I should have gotten rid of his Aatrox. Well, no, that then he'd still be able to replay it. And then, and then, yeah, his Aatrox is leveling no matter what. Yeah, we kill this, which prevents his cane from coming back. Is it the anticipation I like best? No. Can I draw it's my Aatrox, please? God, this guy is so annoying. The child is gone. The killer remains. Could I draw a Trox, please? And now he gets scout. Because of course he does. I will take this power in my lady's name. Because I just can't draw my, my any of my other Aatroxes. Looks like I've got fodder. And this guy is so slow.
for mercy. Obey your master. I beg you for mercy. If we can draw an Aatrox, we're pretty set because we'll have a ton of Darken in hand. Unless you have one. No, we'll actually only have one. And that'll be Darken Aegis. As long as he doesn't draw a strike spell, we're fine. Considering this is accept oblivion. Easy prey. Actually no, we'll have two darken after this. Three actually. Considering there's still the age of song. Look, if you drew something, play it. Okay. Watch him have another one. Yeah. Of course he probably does. Fascinating the overlap between magic and science. That's probably an Aatrox. Give me Aatrox, give me Aatrox, give me Aatrox, give me Aatrox. This is as good a chance I get as any. He just he just drew another one. I was hoping that was the bigger Zalani. Well, that's the one. He had a, he had he had, he had both Aatroxes. And we only had one, and he killed it, and couldn't we couldn't get, bring him back. It was his Aatrox was allowed to stick, and when we finally killed him, he just had another one. Well, we didn't get to have one. So now we're one for two. Let's try to go for two for two. Because our last one went a lot better, despite this one actually being the meta deck. Luckily, we haven't run into a champion strength deck. Hey, that's my old deck. Which I still play sometimes. Well, not, not much as the expansion starts, since, you know, I'm all... I probably should have re-rolled this. That's not a good sign. I don't need a 5 drop. I need a 1 drop. Or a drop. I don't need both my canes! Watch him just aggro me to death. Ready, willing, and learn. Why are you running that? You should be running the elusive. There we go. Terrible things lay inside. Now we can start setting up.
If we seek forgiveness, we must commit all. Is... Our purpose calls to us. We cannot turn away. You're trying to stop two damage. Uh, oh, okay. Forgive me. That seems like it'd be better to spend, like, stunning my Aatrox on turn 10. Diamond people, you shouldn't be, you, you shouldn't be wasting an entire unit just to stop two damage on turn two. I think you just let it hit you. You really don't want to run fire in those decks. It's not worth it. I'm telling you. You have nothing to put the equipment. We fill it. We do have to make sure to take you out. So for four, unless they have another stun, unless maybe they did it because they had multiple stuns in hand. Even then, that's not very smart. No, he isn't. But it's not really gonna matter. Going down this low is not going to help me, I can guarantee that. He is really overestimating himself. He can't aggro us down fast enough, especially considering Aatrox is going to land soon. He's gonna make a big unit, but I'm just gonna block his shadow. What do you call that technique? Only the worthy survive. This is gonna be a big hit, but we can survive this. If he tries to do like a if you do not have a part to play, take one. What we do is so much bigger than us both. Cowards hide, be still. There is no other way.
So if he tries to play something on here, I can just kill him. Drown in shadow! And this is good. Not quite as good as I would have liked. Come on, I'll take you all on. I think I'll prioritize this rather than Shadow Step. That way I can do this. let him do that, he just starts up. So we'll sacrifice something. Take you. You're really gonna put it on that. They follow the wrong master. Heal from that. So I take eight, and then I heal. Why am I not healing from this? I'll just toss you. Should be GG, because I can just replay Ross after this. Behold the might of the dark in Hecarim. I am the world ender! That's the problem when your units only exist on attack. niche ideas like Pantheon, Aatrox. Akshan Aatrox has gained a bit of momentum. Like, I, I don't think I'm going to be doing Auron Aatrox because this deck is utter garbage. So yeah, until next time, my name is Dark and Blade Gaming, and I'm really sorry for not uploading for a week. The flu kind of sucks.